Hey, what is going on guys? So you have a Samsung Smart TV. I'm gonna show you how to screen mirror your Samsung Galaxy Note 20 or Note 20 Ultra, okay? Now, first thing to note is in regarding to the connection, it has nothing to do with your home Wi-Fi network, okay? This is a direct connection from your phone directly to your TV. The thing is, if you want to go ahead and surf the internet, showing something like um, on the internet, like maybe you're browsing a website or something like that, you need internet, It'll use the internet from your phone's home Wi-Fi, or if the Wi-Fi is not connected to home, it'll use your SIM, SIM card data. Now, this is a Miracast connection, just FYI. Once you go ahead and connect the uh, screen mirror, it will turn on your Wi-Fi, but it's, it's, your, it's Wi-Fi direct, all right? So how do you connect? Very, very simple. Grab your phone. You want to go ahead and swipe down like this, little horizontal line right here. Let's swipe down again. What you're looking for is smart view, not screen mirror, smart view. Here's my smart view right here. You may want to look on this side, but mine's on the first page here, smart view. So when I tap on smart view, just give it a second here. This is a Samsung Series 7. Up oh, there it is right here. Tap on that and you get a little message down here. Start casting with smart view. Click on start now. Now the first time you do this, you'll get like a message up here. Your Note 20 or Note 20 Ultra wants to connect. You just grab your remote and click on OK. And then after the first time you do it, every time you connect to the TV again, it doesn't ask you that. So from here, you can show work documents. A lot of you guys are probably here because you want to show photos and videos. So for example, uh, here's a video here. Here's a photo. You can zoom in and out. And I'll show you how to get rid of some of these big black bars too on the TV. So here's your uh, another photo. Here's a video. Let me just go ahead and play this video really fast. And let me, let me raise the volume. Because the thing that you have to know is... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, seven. The audio actually comes from the TV. It comes out from the TV, not the phone. Now, another thing is, too, is as we're screen mirroring here, you have this little floaty icon right here. Now, if I go ahead and tap on this right here... Oh, let me do it again. So if I go ahead and tap on the float, this floaty icon here, if I tap on it this here will pop up down here and you can pause the video from here you can change aspect ratio and you can disconnect now what is phone aspect ratio let me just show you that because a lot of you guys are going to have this question here so you can see i'm on full screen with phone so let me go ahead and go into landscape mode now you can see you see the black bars on top of the tv in the bottom now if we go ahead and go to full screen connect it which is right here now, when I turn it over, you can see there's no black bar now on the actual TV. The whole screen is on there. Now, if you want to go ahead and disconnect, you can simply again tap on that floating icon and tap on disconnect. Or what you can do is you can just go ahead and scroll down and then scroll down again with that little horizontal line is. And now instead of smart view, we're looking because we're connected. We're looking for the name of the actual TV. So Smart View is in here. Let me scroll over here. So Smart View is it's here, but the name changes Samsung Series 7. As you can see, so if I just tap on that, there's another way to uh, turn it off. And there you go. Pretty simple.